This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Well, when we come to you at 2 p.m., we're off 2.6% on the S&P's NASDAQ, down 3.7%. Dow down 2%. Russell off 2 and almost 6 tenths. Crude is up 4%, and gold is down uh, 6 point. Yeah, let's give it 0.66%. Uh, so, man, not quite three quarters, five eighths, something like that. Of course, uh, we continue to look at a market that uh, is headline driven. Uh, the headlines, as we said yesterday, going into a fund buying being over. Uh, this morning we had some jobs numbers, and those, uh, while you would think, would probably just came in line as everybody expected. Uh, some of the other numbers in there people were scratching their heads at, and that was that uh, even though we've got uh, record low uh, uh, unemployment levels, uh, we still are uh, over a million uh, jobs short of uh, pre-pandemic levels. So yeah, they're thinking that uh, and not everything's adding up. I think a lot of people have some other ideas about what's happening in the economy. Um, interesting to look at uh, what uh, some of our hosts talk about sometimes, and that is uh, money coming from uh, other countries. Um, I'm interested to see what happens on Monday when Golden Week is over, whether or not uh, anybody uh, from China starts coming back into U.S. markets. Uh, but, uh, man, uh, I think I watched the most brutal session of Bloomberg at about 2.30 this morning, maybe 3 o'clock. Um, I think a dumpster fire would be... Oh, about a one on the 10 scale that they were at last night in talking, at least in uh, the Far East and Europe, about uh, the United States. They are uh, at least the hosts and most of the guests. Um, pretty bleak. Anyway, we had uh, AMD with an early pre-announcement. We'll talk about this and more in the show following in a minute. The reality is that navigating financial markets can